Hey, Ch Chest Tim. Thank you for the uh, 102 months. We got uh, an Arena Kings at the top of the hour with uh, Grandmaster Ariantari. But uh, big ups to Chest Tim. King, but they this now we're now not they hear the microphone. Hey Lolly, good morning. Alessia, thanks for your raid. Appreciate it. And uh, team in Philly, Philly resubscribed for 49 months prime. Uh, thanks, Tim. Yep, we got Arena Kings real soon. We're just preparing the stream. Thank you, thank you. Tim, I'm uh, observing. Uh, I'm not playing this one, but uh, I'm around. Hey, Latinum. Thanks again to Alessia. That was good.
<laughs> I forget. Getting used to the setup. Um, hello guys, how are you? Just uh, just woke up here, uh, ready to play Arena Kings. Starting in thirty minutes, we'll probably warm up with some games. Hope you hope you guys are doing well. All the boys are here. Aman, Eric, uh, they're helping me to get started. And you got a coffee? Yeah, and I got a coffee. So life is good. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Gory. Gory might still be awake. You never know. Which time zone? Gory, is Gory? did you did you use the code? West Coast. Uh, West Coast. Yes. Trying to see why Gory hasn't counted yet on the counter. Sign up for HelloFresh. Yeah. They were missing three, three people still. Because we were at 12 last night, right? Yeah, we were at 12. So, that's very good, right? 12. It's okay. Hmm. We've been stuck at 11 for a while. We have some goals. Candidates does not start today. Yeah, candidate starts tomorrow. We're very excited. It's, uh... no. There's no chance Gory was the 12, right? That was a while ago. I guess, the, I guess the I guess the pairings I guess the pairings will be announced today after the opening ceremony. Uh, they will probably be going off. Going I think off the lots. pairings are already out. They're already out. But I mean the colors, which already they were out. they were done like a month ago. Yeah. But uh, that was all done February actually. Exactly which color they play each other? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. This was all. They yeah, did at pub chess, buddy. They did at end of oh, February. Wow. Yeah. Okay. That's. Which is I think I think so. A lot of time to prepare. Oh. Jeff went. Jeff went to the join of lots. Yeah. Oh, so, I think Jeff so might have drawn a lot. Jeff's been. <laughs> I think maybe he might Jeff, have drawn a lot. Maybe Jeff's been preparing for some reason. February. I went and I didn't understand it. I just saw them moving a puck around to both sides. <laughs> and... Yeah, Jeff is a secret second for uh, for Hikaru. For Ali Reza, no? Fanboy. Pop chess is tonight, Aryan. Pop chess was also smokes. yesterday and Thursday too because of candidates. They're doing more. Once it's pop chess. well, starting next week. Starting next, next week, week, yeah. Next week. Maybe all the candidates will be at pub chess. We had 102 months from that, Chester. That's why you're here, no? You're the, getting the big guys, aren't you? Yeah, I was going to say, the Hundo club is coming Look up. Look who just party. resubbed. Oh, Kilimanjaro. Thanks for, thanks for your resub. He's, a, uh, he's been watching the channel for many years, right? 105 months 105 is, uh, is I've serious. Him. I've seen him in the chat uh, a lot. The next milestone is 108. The next full year. Nine years. Nine years. That's almost the whole time, right? Because you guys been... I mean, you guys been streaming yeah. for nine years. Ten years next year. You also got a nice raid, Aryan. To start the stream. Yeah, did, I, uh, did, uh, we mentioned that. He's got, uh, Alessia. Yeah. When Aryan streams, he just gets the... No, but it's impressive. Like, it's, I'm, uh, I'm, a it's something, I'm barely even started. I'm a beginner. I don't deserve it. But uh, very, very, appreci very appreciated. Barely even started. Very appreciated. Oh, wow. A big 15-second challenge from uh, Omei out there. Did you do 15 seconds against <laughs> no, 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 no. I was getting my ass kicked against what Gory, do you feel Gory like? playing 15 seconds. Oh, Gory kicked your ass. <laughs> yeah, Gory, I'll have to figure out why that hasn't counted yet. Maybe it's lagged uh, or something, but... You got yeah, my rating, man? I didn't get it back. Not yet, not yet. No, that's a separate thing. Thanks, uh, Chess Tim, Kilimanjaro. You might kill Manjaro. 102, 105. Yeah. You warm up with some puzzle rush to get uh, sharp for the uh, whatever you feel like. Kings. Whatever yeah, you like feel to, like. Usually, when I also trying to work at chess, I start with puzzle rush to just get uh, sharp, uh, get your mind uh, starting to work. <laughs> uh, okay, but then we have to do show browser, right? Uh, because this, uh, the setup is messed up mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. What are you trying to get quick? There's no rush button. So show browser button. Are you okay with that? There we go. I that think that's works. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we put on some music? There is yeah, music yeah, on, yeah. right? Oh, there is just music. On. <laughs> I just didn't see you guys putting. Music. No, I, I didn't. The other thing you have to remember with music is like, uh, especially at night when it's on the headphones, it really travels. Everyone. Hmm. Could be like bad for. Okay, that's great, you guys. You guys we'll be at the fan zone, Kilimanjaro. You know, what we've been advertising for for a while. Uh, just the Chess Pro fan zone is in the venue. Uh, yeah, you literally can't miss us. If you're, uh, if you're at the venue. Oh, Aryan, you minimized it. You don't want to see what things look like? 
There we go. I mean, when you're... Yep. Yeah, you cannot... Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. That's cool. Yeah, exactly, Kilimanjaro. Americans first. What are you scoring in Puzzle Rush? Days, are you? Uh... It's usually like 48 maybe, 49, and I think my record is 52. Uh, what about you? Have you participated in the... I never tried to participate in the I mean, I did it uh, once. Championship. But... The Chess.com has a championship uh, in are December, you, I think. Usually. You're looking to warm up with Aryan Amon? Uh, <laughs> you guys have a puzzle? Uh, yeah. You guys both... Puzzle, puzzle battle. Yeah. Warm up together. <laughs> Morning sesh. I mean, I usually lose against your viewers in puzzle battles, so I'm not... Uh, Really? Oh, like Rui They're or something? Very sharp. Yeah. Yeah, Rui is very, very good. Yeah, you sound like your puzzle score is around mine. Probably a bit better. This is a better move. Almost messed up there. Okay. One of the game is winning. This. Seven. I wish we have seven wins to queen. Take that. Three knights. Take here, queen a three. Hey, Kevin. Kevin, Kevin uh, doesn't show up this early. I mean, normally. Kevin is very happy because he beat me at uh, checkers. But yesterday. I'm surprised Kevin's awake based on uh, his hours last night. He had a lot of energy. He didn't go to bed early. Neither yeah, did I. Yeah, he didn't want to. He didn't want to watch a movie with me and me and Jeff. He went to sleep so he could watch the stream. Uh, but were you guys watching a movie? Because I came downstairs and I. Oh, we we did because because, so because Kevin so Kevin all. Kevin left so we were. And you guys we didn't want to. Oh. Oh. I watched the movie. The uh, champ gave hundred subs. And uh, oh, now, yeah. I, now I'm depressed <laughs> from the movie. Which movie was that? <laughs> Million Dollar Baby. I think it won uh, the Oscars for that year. It's a good movie, but uh, to say... Uh, Is that a long time ago? or uh, 2004 or something, but uh, I'm ready to give a full report when Champ is here. Okay, this one is... It's not a feel-good movie. Which, oh. which probably is why it's a very good movie. <laughs> wow. It's a good thing you got that one, are you? I uh, just <laughs> reviewed, games I reviewed are, that exact position. Pawn and games are hard. Pawn and games uh, are very hard. two days ago. Uh, that was very stupid. I didn't solve that like hickey. Yeah, it's a muscle memory. <laughs> <laughs> I, I really don't know what that was. That was not F3, probably. Yeah, uh, this is in the way as well. It gets in the way for me. Can very nice uh, 49 to start yeah, off. Yeah, 50 is. You said 52 uh, is your high? I feel like yeah, that's a good score. I think so, yeah. 50, 50 is very uh, impressive in general, but F49 is not bad. But yes, so that's right, Tim. This Jim, uh, Puzzle. Squidward, thanks for the thanks for the re resub. That's that's almost six read, years, right? You didn't read the full username. <laughs> six years? Squidward. Squ tennis you really want me to read the whole username? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a troll. He's a troll. He's a uh, Squidward tennis balls. Yes. I think Aryan's uncomfortable saying tennis balls. <laughs> Don't wanna. Okay, that's. L Lolly, you can't complain about the sub battles when you're retired, when you stopped uh, fighting for the boys. Yeah, we could have used we a soldier used... like Lolly yesterday. Like Lolly, like you're. He would have done better than J Bell, that's for sure. <laughs> J Bell? What happened with J Bell? J Bell had a rook, two pawns, a bishop against the rook. That's it. And up time, like up four seconds, 15 seconds to 11, and he lost on time. Yeah, that's, Am Am Amon's being nice that's too happened. because he could have been up like bombs. four pawns. That's one of the craziest things. He had like I've 30 seconds or something. Yeah, at yeah, the start yeah. Of the he was thing. like up a piece, like dominating the whole, whole game. He must, like, he must have been on his phone. Not only was he. Technique was very bad. Sighting that's the, the phone, point. But like oh. he was trying to go for a mate when he could just like promote a pawn. But yeah. then his mate failed and the king started running away at the end. Yeah, he could so. win that in a million ways. Uh, that was. 
Well, and if you want to go for the mate, he just doesn't need to lose those kingside pawns. Because he yeah. always plays tile twos if you don't, don't have to have triggers on his pawn. Yeah, 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 but then it's not an excuse. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah, but li he literally didn't have to do anything. Um, yeah. He could just wait and win the game. <laughs> <laughs> correct, correct. Yes. Your favorite uh, Tom is here. Tom Peplo? <laughs> I'm a. Uh, he's. Uh, he's he said he's coming to he's Toronto. Coming after ev end of, everything uh, finishes. <laughs> I'm looking, looking forward to see you, Tom. After the action is all over. How are things going? Yes. General showing up to the smoke battlefield. No, the, the two bellies from Britain, right? They're yeah. assessing, like, after, getting the credit. Just after around. action. <laughs> yes. They're going to run the AAR. Have we killed the commie fox? <laughs> I don't know what that was. Uh, what are you? Yeah. What move? What's yours? Hey, grilled peppers! I got some news for you. Underdog has chest lines, not in Ontario, but the rest of Canada the candidates so you and maybe some of your co-workers you can get them to load up an account bet on some chess have some fun because the lines uh even big mckinnon already put in some lines uh i saw saw the pickums there and uh yeah, yeah i think a lot of people here yesterday but we can't a lot of people here are going to be really keen on uh Picaro's 7.75 Mattis, can you get uh, your partner as well to sign up? That was a master, guys. That was a master. Can you get your partner as well to sign up? Let's get everyone on board. This is a big push. You beat it, you too. Can you get some of your friends? Beats has a partner. You beat it has has a partner, mm -hmm. and his partner might have a partner. I was going to say. Same thing. Are you looking forward to meeting Yubitsu's wife? Uh, yeah, is she coming to the fan zone or? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh. Looking forward to see everyone. Looking forward. No crack in this one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Polly <Paul> Yev. <laughs> People like your shirt. It's very. Uh, it's an underdog shirt. And it's an underdog cute. shirt. It's a sponsor shirt. I remember you were wearing this in Norway. I remember. It's uh, oh, yeah. like the co like the colors. Trying to get some signups. Very fresh. I actually already got comments on that by uh, Serena downstairs, uh, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Her reps. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What were the comments? She she asked me what the spelling is saying. That's, that's what she asked. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not. She says nobody wears gant here in Canada, so she, she asked about the asked, asked about the brand. They do have gant in Canada. I saw it. It's quite expensive. That's but what I don't. That's I don't what know. I'm it was like no, yeah. Or, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm also saying that you have it in Nordstrom. Uh, uh, I've definitely seen it. Okay. Now it's, it's at the bay. I've just never seen anybody. I've just never seen anybody wear it here. No. No, it seems pretty expensive. That's right, Abraham Lincoln. Sports betting meets chess. Absolutely, the link is sports, and they do have the chess lines. This is a perfect time to get everyone in. Tim, SA Raider. But Ariana, how do we get you hyped up for Arena Kings? It starts in 15 minutes, and it's all about the speed. I can't play right. some bullets. Uh, what, whatever gets you ready. Do you need music to get you ready? Like, the Arena Kings is like boom, 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 two hours of nonstop. Uh, Ubitsa, it's not a Norwegian uh, brand, it's, uh, it's American sportswear, but uh, it's very popular in Norway and, and Europe in general, but not here in, uh, not here in Canada. It's, not, it's definitely not as big as Balenciaga. Uh, well, okay, let, let's, you won't see let's people wearing some... Balenciaga here unless they're like Chinese or something. Yeah, unfortunately, Dubo, very... unfortunately Dubov is not playing the candidates, so uh, we're not going <laughs> to see... It's one of those labels, well, A, it's expensive, see, uh, B, any players it's... wearing Balenciaga, but... Alireza, Alireza likes to 
likes to wear Dabble. Balenciaga. Yeah. He's a fashionista. Yes. He's a maestro. <laughs> He's, yeah. He knows his stuff. Oh, we got a new guy for you here. Oh yeah, yeah, you can read it from there too. Same guy. Oh, uh, thanks, uh, thanks, Bramore. T tier one, six months. I noticed yesterday there was quite a few people that subbed three months in advance. It almost seemed like peculiar that so many people did it. I haven't seen it too much, but a bunch of people subbed three months in advance. That's funny. Oh, uh, Golovan resubbed re for six to eight months. He's been subbed for seven years. I so. appreciate it. <laughs> so, so 68, let's try. I know, I know what you're trying to do. That's good. But now we have to work on the uh, math there. Uh, I just took it very fast. I, that was a guess. No, but I know, I know. No, that's good. Convinced, I'm, 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 I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. Now we're. Uh... In fact, I think you convinced him for a time. <laughs> so, so five times five times twelve is sixty. Yes. That we, we agree on that. Right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> We've proven that theorem. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's let's so work out from there. So, so it's between five years and six years. So it's five years and eight months. Yeah, it's not seven years. Okay, I just. Said something at the top of my. But you know head. that he's gonna be around. It's, for seven. it's, it's yes. close. It's closer to six years, but I, uh, I, I trust Golovan to be to be around for seven years. Exactly. And, uh, oh, there we go. Exactly. You trust him to be around. That's the type of that. That's the comment. See, now he's gonna stay here for seven years, because you said that. Be you trust because you you, yeah. Put trust hopefully, in him. Ho hopefully, not gonna let us let us down. Hey, Mr. Monopoly, saw some H uh, two speed runs uh, last week. Madison and I. I think it was a warthog uh, run actually. Could be wrong. A scarab. Oh, Jesse James. Jesse James uh, reset for six months. Thanks. Um. Yeah, it's not often you guys see three GMs. Uh, the... They were at the basketball game yesterday. I saw. I saw some of the seconds. Fishy right. Was. Fishy and Esipienko. <coughs> <laughs> Big dish. <laughs> Ali Reza, was he wearing Gucci? Abbas posted Abbas something and... on Instagram too. I don't know if that's Abbas was... and Mamad over there. Okay. <laughs> Any thoughts? Raptors were then playing? some people. Yeah, the Raptors are one of the worst teams in the league, and they've been like that. Were for they a while. playing at least a decent team? Lakers. That sounds awful. Lakers. Oh, oh, yeah, that's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. If you get to see, yeah, LeBron in Canada, that's pretty rare. Oh wow. Well, if you're interested, when the Lakers come by, Mon, uh, Lamicky. Not too many uh, chances to see Lamicky. <laughs> Might be resting as well. Ryan, uh, uh, I'm waiting for. Uh, I'm not sure you're gonna. Oh. oh, for what? Just when you said that, Eric. The prophet. No? You're playing a prophet. Wow. <laughs> Moses. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jeff watching Moses. Yeah. Is <laughs> no, I really like that. Show. I've seen. I've it's seen very it, like, recommended. It's, it's very. This show. It's one of I the, love that Moses. It's like show. the worst show. I think. <laughs> <laughs> it helps if you believe in it. I. It's trying to. I, get some I don't mind believing guys. in it. Uh, but I find the adaptation. Uh, lacking. Yeah, but you know me. I'm not like that critical. Like, oh, oh, you're happy for Moses. So you <laughs> can see that. I want Moses to do well. <laughs> I even told my parents to watch it. Oh, oh. <laughs> now, so if you get anyone else to watch it, then I'll be super. No, seriously, then I will join. Get anybody else. You rope anyone yes, on the couch. Just like Moses. To watch Moses. <laughs> Arian will watch it, I'm sure. But will he know what's happening? We can watch it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was easy. Is Halliburton back? Yeah, he had a good game two days ago. Anybody here watches Moses on Netflix? What Jeff's <laughs> watching right now? No, I'd be, Let I'd me know about your feedback. Just, oh, three episodes. just curious to hear what you think. Uh, if you want to try it out, whether you believe in Moses, uh, maybe not, maybe you do, but uh, it, it's a tough one for me. Actually, Gory maybe can uh, try it out. 
What? Wow. Is it banned or? No. Why do you resign? I, I don't know. <laughs> you're Probably saying got they banned, got... right? No. He's just giving you respect because <laughs> he's a prophet. No, but sometimes it happened to me when I'm playing in the game. So totally just, stops. just click the account. You'll know if they got banned or not. You got banned? That would be. Yeah, but that's usually what happens if no, no, but just in the middle yeah, of the game. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, but that'd be crazy. Just check. Their account's not banned. You don't have to scroll down. You can just see at the top. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> like, that'd be insane if you just, like, this I am. But is just it, gets it, banned on stream. Yeah, like, on stream while you're playing him. That'd be insane. <laughs> but it's weird to resign in an equal position, though. It's so, so weird. Uh, I don't know. The guy maybe, would, like, maybe, let the clock run. Maybe it's a misclick. Maybe he clicked. No, um, maybe he's playing in school. I resigned all the time growing up playing chess in school. Yeah, I've been when I grew up playing, we weren't allowed to play chess in school. It was considered not even a game. It was like wasting time. Like during educational period, it didn't count. So if a teacher was coming yeah. by, they didn't respect chess in your school. Well, in Canada, they don't respect chess it's in general. Yeah. But I feel I'm like sure. I would just let the uh, like I would just hopefully the candidates. Yeah, yeah, yeah just ho some, ho but, but sometimes you just close out entirely, and maybe that. It's a lot of respect from him. Yeah, to resign. Yeah. Are you uh, registered, by the way? Are you just? Uh. No, I'll play one more and then, then go and register. Uh, yeah, I think you can. Are you gonna play? get music to hype yourself up? Headphones, speakers. I'll, I'll Do put you need the ten minutes when the pyramid starts. Do you I'll want speakers my... right now and to hype yourself up, or or what are you looking for? How do we get you energetic? energetic? How do we get me activated? Yeah. Do you want a shot? I can... No, no. <laughs> there will be drinks tonight, so then you should maybe go to pub chess after. I mean, in I always like to go to pub chess. Oh, I mean, like, oh, in, my, you, in my previous times when I was tell, here. Did you tell G Man that? Yeah, tell G Man. Because he asked. G Man, I'm going to. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, I can't. Okay. <laughs> We're talking about the G Man must be listening. Sorry? <laughs> We're talking about the message he sent. <laughs> Sorry. The message on Instagram, remember? Jonathan, you? G Man? Oh, Gunjan? You don't know Gunjan. Gunjan oh, you call Gunjan G Man? <laughs> I didn't know you called him Gunjan. I mean, how could I know that you call him Jimin? Uh, his name is his name has always been Gunjan to me, but uh, I didn't know you called him that. I really didn't his know. kick username is Gman the Brown. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. But he's not here. Actually, he must be listening. So you speak to him through the cyber. I haven't seen him much in the chat in general. Though. Moses. <laughs> I haven't seen Jimin much in the chat. No, no, he doesn't come on You're Twitch. Right. But I was uh, saying that if you go and you tell people, there's gonna be a big crowd. We're gonna do vol volume is this. Practice, practice oh, no. touching. Sorry. No, practice touching the knobs. It's going down. Yeah, you see. Yeah. Also, Aryan, maybe your friends will be there. Friends. Paul J B. Old JB, th thanks for the thanks for the uh, tier one. Gifted, eh? Gifted, gifted a tier one to Funky Monk. Well, that's very nice. Mon, how's the energy? Good morning, You're... Ralph. Is Arian, uh, How are you doing? Waking you up there with no, the... <laughs> no. <laughs> Stiff, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we'll we'll uh, register for a tournament. It's uh, nobody's. So, so gonna, to find a tournament, game. <clears throat> you know to find a tournament. It's not like Title Tuesday where they have it show up at the top. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Should we just show browser to show the players? Ab yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's fucking typical. It's all the. Last Who week. Who are the usuals, Jeff? Uh, Kamsky is playing um, just um, Sichev. Sichev is a Three, Russian four, GM, I think. Thanks for your raid, uh, Road to GM. Thanks for your raid. I appreciate it. Raiding get with some, a party of 199. Uh, we get some different raids when the stream's on early. Yeah, it's two so far uh, Alessia and, and Road to GM. So this nice. field, Arian, there's a good chance to do well here. Um, I mean, Yostin, Hikaru is not playing before. His turn last, doesn't start before tomorrow, so la, he might yeah. show up suddenly. Yeah? No, I mean, he, 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 this I is the best uh, warm-up for him. I've been like beat, like last week I beat Yospin, and I still like 
I don't even think won a prize or you won played prize. really well last week. Yeah, and I just didn't. It's just like the the way they. I lost to other people. It really is based on luck, though. Like, did you see we have like four mods, and it took like fourteen messages to get his channel shouted out. Really impressive, the collective IQ from the mods. So four mods. I know uh, Gori is a mod, and uh, so people with a sword have a mod. Have mod. So they have a sword in chat. The green sword, yeah. And you know all Kevin, of them. Kevin, Tom, and there's somebody up there. Gori. Lethbridge chat. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not sure who Jeff Lethbridge chess is, but. Uh, well. Um. Okay. Wow, this is Intel Tuesday, Papa Jokester. If it was Title Tuesday, uh, Kramnik and uh, the crew would be around. <laughs> Smart project. MC, dude, <laughs> dude, Shogun is a fantastic show. Dude, the last episode... I didn't even think we'd get action, but they're clearly building it up. There's still three more, but like, so it's, it's got me hooked. Like, I just can't wait for the next episode of Shogun. Is it better than Moda? Way better. I mean, it's like rated nine, and Moda is like a low seven. I've well, fish on fish. I've been talking about three body problem on stream, oh, and then yeah, what was cool is then one of the. Actors, his nephew is a stream viewer. <laughs> I hope you can make an exception. Exception. Uh, That's not true, fish. fish. Are you? Did, did you see this at all? Oh, Valentinian, subscribed for 51 months. Then we have to do the math again. We have to do the math again. You have to do the math. I said... Uh, so the easy thing to remember on Twitch is multiples of 12. 12 5 times 12 is 60, so... He's, 4 times 12 is 48. He's 51 months. Yeah, it's somewhere between 4 and 5. <laughs> 4 <laughs> years, 3 months. Two, 4 years, 3 four months. Years, two months. 4 three, years, 2 months. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You're sharper. You're Actually, sharp. Gory, your friend, said 5 years, 3 months. Well, Gory is the one that's in... But he's American. Yeah, but he's also the one that is in, in school, right? So he... Well, he gave the wrong answer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Better to not go at school. Go to go to school. Didn't... You said it's between four and five, right? And you said five years. It's 12, 24, 36, 40... Oh, he's blaming it's hard to type. 60... <laughs> yeah. 70, Blame, bro! 72, 84, 96, 108. It's good to have excuses. Exactly. Good to have excuses. J Bell and Gory are both drinking from the well. Oh, not Danny joined you. That's okay. Call it there's, too soon. There's Call a lot of prizes. Soon. There's a lot of prizes. You know what they're doing? Okay, that's fine. He'll place each other. Lots of prizes, and it's about pairings. You can do very well here. Uh, he puts reset for for thirty five months. He wants me to do some uh, math. Matt, probably, again. Um, so what I would do here, I'd be like, Hipbots, thanks for the sub. See you next month for your that's three... Almost three, three, three years. Three yeah, I'll see, see, one see, month, one see you next oh, yeah. year for your three-year anniversary. Next month, right? Three yeah, three because years. at three years, they get a new badge. The okay. colors of the viewers, the subscriber badge changes per year. This, this badge, you mean? Exactly. Right? Different colors for different years. But, so now he has to come back, because you called it so out. So May will be a very special month for him. Yeah. Because he'll be in because one it's month. Your birthday. No, in one month you'll be playing a tournament on stream. Your tournament? No, you'll be playing a FIDE tournament. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> oh me? Or I thought you said him. I'm yeah. I'm playing. I'm playing for him. <laughs> I thought you said he's <laughs> playing on stream. Yeah, I'm playing in Cayman Island with uh, uh. with Eric. Um, I. <laughs> Are you playing? Maybe I'll. Have... I thought you say Hippo is playing. Uh, the candidates doesn't start money, Bert. There's no fan zone today. Wow, you got Kamsky. Okay. Good luck, buddy. So now, yes. what do we do? We'll play Switch okay. the Scene. 
Or... Playing Kamski, uh, a legend. The big legend. French born legion. Go knight c3, knight c6. Let's go a4. I'm starting with. He's going here and. Pepsi uh, and espresso. Try to go knight d5. Great start to the day. Pepsi, espresso, and then maybe some. E4, knight d5. Uh, Jason, this is not title, uh, this is not title Tuesday. Title Tuesday is the only tournament with that. Arena Kings, anything goes. Chats allowed. Subs are allowed. Weebs are allowed. Lady Mariko is allowed from Shogun. She can say hi. I want to go here, but then he has 95. Uh, need to come up with a smart move here. C3. Noted him on. Let's go here. Platonic plays. Nine five probably have to go queen e two. Let's Thank you for the prime. Opening didn't go well here. Uh, we're not having the best position. Let's try to try to play f four. There is no increment here, by the way, so it's uh, very different from Title Tuesday. Uh, time is much more important. At least a knight on e3 is uh, protecting. Should not have allowed g4. I don't know why it allowed g4. Sleep well, Gory. Getting my rook trapped here. Better to resign this so we don't lose time. That was a bad game. I uh, got my rook trapped in b6. I should never have allowed him to play g4. I should have played f4 before. We spent a lot of time in the opening, which usually isn't a good idea in Arena Kings. Yes. There's no increment and you just had a bad position. My opponent just mess messaged, he's been watching the pre-show. A lot of people watch your pre-show. <laughs> just trying to get warmed up. Very stiff. What? You guys are both oh, these positions. You're... What do you want me to do? Well, you get this position for black as well. It's very cute. I've seen you play this already today, this structure. What I want you to do, run them over. You know this opening well, you can crush them. Yeah, I can't just mate him out of nowhere. Oh, you, you'll get a good... You'll get a good position from this. You got this.
trying to to make some threats here. I'm almost tempted to take and check in rookie tree. Um, not sure if it works. But let's try. Let's try to have some fun. This we always have G6. G6, queen H6. Don't really see how he protects. Probably this he wants F5. Also take first. F6, we can take, take, check, king f7, uh, rook f1. I think it's just uh, winning here. Then g7 drops. King eight. Has some queen g5 ideas. Okay, it's not. Have to be accurate. Ah, I kind of misplay this. My king, my king suddenly got into trouble there, but uh, we'll try to, we'll try to flag him. Let's go here, gotta make some threats. It's not a plan to spend so much time winning this game, but <laughs> not much to do. This rook f7. Probably have to take. Queen c4. Have this. But, uh, he actually this is very good. Rook e6. Rook f1 with take. A big struggle, a very big struggle. Yeah, let's try to get the king in. All about time here, guys. Okay, we get this one. That was... that was embarrassing. Fatmo, thanks for the 13 months. I should have been ready for that. That was... Uh, that was very stupid. We're off to a very slow start. We need to win some quick games here. Kevin, you and Val, I uh, 
trust you guys will uh, be Aryan's cheerleader for this. Are you going? I have to do some stuff, but I'll be around. Okay. I'll be around. You're in good hands. And you just got some bits from Polar Bear, a thousand. Just, just need to play days. some better chess. Hey, Polar Bear, that's super kind. Thanks, man. Aryan's just warming up there. Dirty move here, dirty move there. It works, it works. Try to not lose a pawn here. Not sure about that, Kevin. Uh, do we have a lot of time though? It's two hours. I just uh, gotta get some points. Thanks for sharing, Polar Bear. It's okay, it's okay. I have to get used to that, uh, pandas. I try to play b5. Now I realize that I should not have should not have done that. That was it's created weaknesses, but uh just need to try to win a bit faster because in Arena Kings you just have two hours, so you don't have time to mess around. Should be seven would be stronger to pressure this pawn. Trying to get the rook over here. Give me some rook h4 ideas. Don't know what I'm doing, uh, just Messing up every game here. This is the worst start in the history for Anna Kings. <laughs>
Oh my god, I should have taken the draw there. I should have taken the draw there. Uh, got a bit too... Too ambitious. Playing Bok with half out of three. A5, A4 maybe? Ninety six probably. Let's take ninety five. Don't know why I play this opening. It's quite hard to win. Let's try to activate the rook. That last game was... The worst. Might take... It's uh, not a very fun position. It's quite drawish, probably. Here, maybe? This pawn is uh, not really that weak, because we can always put it on a4. We'll try to push some pawns, get the king, get a king active. He wants to go bishop d1 to put pressure on this pawn. You can always make a draw here, but uh, you need to figure out a way to, to play. I think I might be better. We go here. Rook a8, king f8. King e7. Try to get the king out so we can activate the uh, bishop. Take here. I thought I had this, but that's not really the case. Try to push the A-pawn. That's probably just a draw. He's going to take and go here.
almost messed up there. <laughs> that was, uh... I mean, first it was very drawish, but I was trying to win, and then I messed up and blundered f7 pawn. But uh, he blundered uh, the f2 pawn suddenly. But uh, we... we... Yeah. <laughs> just, try, just try to stop the bleeding there. You gotta win some quick games. But yeah, very important to stop the bleeding. Go d4. Thanks for the support, Josh. Let's take go e5, knight e4. Bishop is bad on g7. Queen e1, we don't want to trade queens. Did I just blunder a piece? Okay, we gotta play play with a piece down now. Uh ninety four was should just play a four or something. I don't move too faster. Yeah, we'll try to fight on. G4. This is hanging. We have this. We're hoping for this because then we have knight c3. That would be a blunder we need to see to save this. I'm just lost, of course, so I'm gonna try to make something, something happening. Some threats. Yeah, we cannot we cannot afford to trade queens here. Uh because Rook is also hanging there. And at least now his time is a bit less and F7 is hanging. Maybe we have some small practical chances to take here. Don't really have a lot of we're two pieces down and we don't really have a lot of threats, but we just gotta keep it going and try to win on time or something. This is not that easy for him anymore. Heal. So ninety eight ideas.
Okay, there we go. Now we're winning. Okay, there goes the bishop. Okay, these games are <laughs> these games are awful, but uh, at least we got it was a nice comeback. Thanks for your support, guys. <laughs> Playing with a piece less after the opening against the IM is not uh, not the best <laughs> circumstances to deal with, but you just gotta fight on, especially in. Blitz without increment, anything can happen really. So uh shouldn't give up. Can do this. Very tempted to go E5 or something, uh just to open up stuff. I'm just not sure it's working. Bishop D6, yes, C5. D5, D5, Bishop G4, DC. Yeah, and I don't see anything there. Yeah, I just gotta gotta move faster. At least trying to open. He's gonna go to knight g3 though. He's gonna go knight g3, bishop d7. Try to get the king to safety. We do this. Looking very shaky, just trying to hold on somehow. Get the knight to g5, that would be great. He wants bishop b4 here. You gotta take some care. With d5 we go b6 and knight b7 stuff. C5, C6. Don't really want to trade, especially with the time situation. Hoping I can have some F4 stuff. Bishop d5, I have to go... Maybe I blundered bishop d5 and I don't... There's no way to I can capture on... I can capture with the queen and try to take this. It's 
that's bad. Yeah, this is really bad. Uh, Nine of four. Yeah, I can just take it. I think. Uh, that was a bad game. I'm getting tough pairings. Uh, I feel I have very little points, but then I'm playing Buck. Two games against Buck. He wants to play d5, I think. Let's go queen e2 so we can go e5. Maybe h4, h5. can take rook g1. F4, c3. I'm getting end games all the time. I want to play more entertaining chess than that. That's not easy. I want to go g5. don't really want to play, let him play g5, so I think we should go g5. Just to control, control some squares. But playing this end game with our score is not. Maybe the H pawn is. We can hope for some sacrifice on G6 at some right moment. We don't like this position. Just go here. I just don't know what to do. I don't really have have a plan. It's a problem. We'll take this. Go H six. Not really. Yeah, Druk takes e3 there, so that wasn't working. I try to activate the Rook. I might go rook b8 though. Here. I 
I have nothing to do. I want to go a4, maybe rook b5. Rook b1 stuff. I think he blundered, but it's still not easy at all, probably. And now we're starting to look very good. He's also on the agenda. We, uh, he blundered in the end, but it was not so easy because he had uh, rook c8 check suddenly. I had a similar position against uh, Hikaru yesterday, uh, structure, let's go e6, bishop b6. I appreciate the sub, uh, David. David Oi. Uh, I don't deserve it with my chest, but still appreciate it. We just want to develop here with 97, take it from there. Should be fine for, for uh, black. He's trying to play very positional here with knight c5. Let's go knight g6, rook e8. Gotta try to make our own threats. Bishop c8, some ideas like this. H5, h4. Soon, hopefully, uh, MC. It was fun to watch with uh, with Eric the other day. He tried to play nine f five. King f7 next, maybe. Yeah, I don't know what else to do.
go g5. Another dry end game. It's gonna go king a5. Knight e3, knight b4. <laughs> it's not a easy position. Try to play c5 there. This one. Little vendor B six. This is some kind of uh, Maroxy now. Uh, try to play F four. Yeah, playing Kamski there after losing is not not an ideal pairing, but that doesn't accept uh, the, the play. But I appreciate it a lot, uh, Jay, for uh, for tipping. I'll try. I'll try. Trying to trap the bishop on g4. Probably going f4. Go here, bishop b6. Okay. I uh wonder to be two pump, of course. We should still be I'm very surprised that he didn't take the rook. Or should be should be in business again. Let's see seven maybe. Take this pawn.
Uh, no, no, no. It's fine. C5. It's going here. I think we can take on d6 there. It's trying to open up. To b4. g5. The problem with winning the uh the problem with this game is it's just uh winning it so s slow. We're not exactly in the good standings. Doesn't matter if he gets We have to flag Rook against Rook. Definitely some work to be done. So he played very well. Uh, he. Created a lot of chances. It should be four, maybe. It should be just a pawn up here. We take this, knight b5, queen b8, queen d4, knight c6. We could also do this, probably more practical. c5. Skipping the extra pawn. We just go bishop d4 next. When f4 is a good move.
try to push the try to push the A pawn. Just rook c8. This I kind of regret it. I think G six was more practical, but just try to be fancy there. Is hanging. It's this he wants to go e6, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's just try to carry that threat. Here. Here, we have some push before ideas. I want to check and take d2 with the bishop. Brain is not working today. This is insane guys, this is insane. I, I don't know what to say, this is the worst hour of chess you guys have seen in your life, probably. We're on last place, trying to... <laughs> Maybe h6.
I go d4, but he has d g4. Do we go here and try to play? I tried to play knight d3. I'm hoping for that he takes a knight f3. Then we had queen c4. But... Okay. Takes one. We're going a6. To get this knight into the game. Queen d7, maybe try to play c5. Let me go here. Didn't like queen b6 because he had knight d7. This. Yeah, he just blundered. Oh, is he really gonna play on? It's just like... Not good for any of us. Oh, the maiden one is 
I'm not capable to see that, uh, Sleazy. That's 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 too much for me. That's that's over my brain capacity. No, that's that's too hard. That's too hard. Don't expect that from me, guys. Got a London with a bit of a weird move order here, which I didn't expect. Here he wants to take and take this. Can we go 95. I really want to take uh, E3 is probably going to be weak, but it's not. I don't clearly see how he is going to make advantage of it immediately. Probably should be six. Takes, takes. Got to play C5. So here. Pretend that we're threatening something. six gotta get rid of this knight it's quite it's been uh, a bit annoying the whole game Five is ugly. We gotta open for open up for the bishop. Try to activate the knights here. Probably not a good idea, but I'm uh, gonna try to trade because otherwise this pawn is very weak all the time. I want to take, but uh, queen d3 and knight d1 is a problem, I think. D6.
saved. Get rid of this bishop. I tried to play d4. d4 takes, takes. On c5. Yeah, it's hard to not tilt after these games. Rook c3 is a good move, protecting f3. Is gonna to try to make a draw here, but we'll play we'll play d4. Stuck stuck with this weakness on c5. Really hoping for rook a8 there, but he found this. F3 is a good move. F3 is a very good move there. I want to do this, but I'm not really... I gotta run the king over, I think. This guy sees everything too. Yeah, it should be winning.
Well, let's just try to win a couple of games because we're not gonna we're not gonna finish in first uh, or top three. That's that's for sure. Don't want to go 94 because then we allow him to play 9 of 5. Go over here maybe. Probably gonna take him night before or something. Or or this directly. So uh, we should be doing with the bishop well with the bishop on d6 because it restricts black's uh, black's play here. Take. Yeah, I don't know. Let's play f4. They try to get this knight out somehow. Yeah, I wanted to take on g6, but uh, I'm not sure if it works really. But okay, let's try. It doesn't doesn't really matter. I'm really not used to this Arena Kings format. The thing is, it's like the second time I'm playing where you have to win win quickly. Uh, it's not been working out. Go here. Gotta try to keep the knight on e6 alive. It's a very strong piece. It takes, we get rookie one. It's just not... Not easy for, for black to play here. D6, yeah, rook D8. I think we have, uh, I take C5 and Twenty six. Uh, I think he blundered. Uh, blundered that.
Is this uh, transposing into some kind of Arukan here? Maybe C5. Try to challenge the uh, challenge the center. Should be three logical. Sequence is seven. Rook D1 was not, not so smart because uh, we got this with tempo, but I mean it's not not a disaster for him to play to play rook D to D2. Let's just get the rook into play. Maybe some bishop before ideas. Eric's uh, definitely not impressed with this this chess. He should have played instead. That's that's smart. He didn't really. Hoping for something like this. I completely missed knight to six there. Maybe we will try to buy the king on g seven. Better do something. Hopefully, rookie one. Do you really just want to draw here? Let's try. We cannot make a draw here. That would be... Gotta try to get out of this diagonal. Threats. I think the worst is the worst is probably over here. Now we blundered this.
Uh, I cannot I cannot play on here, unfortunately. I I I don't want to make a job with it. It's like no, what can I do here? Uh, it's hard to protect f7 there. Queen d6, rook f6 was the only way I I saw at least. Yeah, you have to go king e8 there after e6. Taking on e6 is too much. It would be fun if we could castle and mate, but uh, unfortunately that's... I don't know which one you guys think is cooler, knight e2 or knight h3 or g3. You decide. Which one do you want? Okay, H3. I just took the first. Just took the first. That is tree is stiff because you go backwards, so yeah, I would I would definitely not choose that one. I would probably choose G3. Pawn mates are yeah, I think I feel pawn mates are in general very cool. Definitely want to keep this bishop in this diagonal, so queen c1 makes makes sense. Yeah, top top two hundred is the dream at this point. That would be a uh, very big achievement.
I don't really want to allow any D3 business. Tony looks at this, but he actually he can go here. Here or here? Right to bring the bring the rook in. F five was a good move because uh, now he connects connects his rook. I'm not sure about e5 because now his king is potentially in some trouble at least. Felt a bit premature, maybe he should have tried to I'm very tempted to just sacrifice here. I should just gonna I'm just gonna do it. Rook takes rook g5 ideas. Looks looks dangerous at least. Yeah, I mean, I, I blundered queen d5, uh, Excella. Uh, that was not, that was not the intention there. That that's that's for sure. I wanted to put it on e5, but he, I only looked at queen b6. So that being said, my brain is uh, not working today. I uh, played better in title Tuesday yesterday. It's a good move. Or. Is it here? Okay, it makes sense to start with this at least. Yeah, I mean, finally, this bishop on a tree says hello, so that was uh, becomes high energy in the end. Yeah, at least we have uh, another GM suffering with us, so we're not alone. Go e six. Gotta put the bishop on b three here, because it's not doesn't really have any future. Otherwise, I mean, it's not doing anything on b five at least. Let's go rook c1. This pawn on c2 is usually usually a bit weak, so that's something we have to take care of here. That's why I'm tempted to play c4 to, to get rid of the weakness. Let's try. He probably gonna take. I managed to stabilize these pawns, I'm better. It's easier said than done. E4 maybe? Let's try to... Maybe g3, king g2, or h3. Okay, we don't really need to care about this pawn, I think. I'm 
we need a way to improve our position. It's not easy. I mean, he doesn't have any weaknesses, so it's not easy to... Improve. Maybe some rookie five ideas. Very tempted to do this. Like takes, takes, yeah, of course he's not gonna, doesn't need to take. Just need some way to make progress, but it's not, let me go E6 here. Maybe he has queen d4. Moving too slow here. Definitely moving too slow. Why did I make that pre-move? Uh, <sighs> and then playing board next suddenly. Yeah, I wanted to remove that pre-move. I just wanted to catch up on time. Uh, that was a stupid pre-move. I should have assumed that he plays King G King G six there. King G seven there. I was gonna play h6. Uh, everything is everything is going wrong today, guys. I was gonna play h6, not g6. I made a mouse slip there. Your rook h8 was such a such a necessary pre move.
Oh wow. Got this. That's a very tricky move. Do we have a way to protect our stuff? Ninety four was really clever. This rook is hanging actually. Two. can actually just take it probably because here he has king h king h1 and don't really don't really see the mate I think he misplayed this for sure. That's very unfortunate. That's Now we're playing Just Film. I'm playing uh, super tournaments and trying to make it into top top two hundred. When a seven, he had queen e four. It didn't really work. I was hoping for that to work, but yeah, I mean, it's almost if he wouldn't have queen a eight there and protected g two, we would be winning. But yeah, it's wasn't the case. Try to play f5. Probably play it here. d5, knight, a5. I was thinking some ninety five bishop g four stuff. Mm. 
Let's take... Can take and take. That's a good move. Should not have taken on B4, probably. Yeah, I've been moving way too slow this game. Ah, uh, sorry guys, this is... Yeah, I don't know what to say. I'm sorry you have to watch so bad chess. This is, I'm low on time and I'm trying to play fast. It's very hard to... Yeah. Uh, it's my fault, I'm spending too much time. Yeah, one thing is not winning that position, but losing it was...
Yeah, it's like when you get when you get that end game, you you just know like the only thing you have to do is to not blunder a fork, and then you're telling yourself that all the time, and then it finally happens. Like you know, in life sometimes you just tell tell yourself tell yourself this this doesn't have to happen, this doesn't have to happen, this doesn't have to happen, and then that happens. It's just too thinking about something too much, and then it happens. That's. Uh... Yeah, but I should never put my rook. I was trying to put it as far as possible from the king, but it's. I mean, it's hard with ten seconds, of course. I I just have to play faster there before. Yeah, it doesn't matter, Hans. I appreciate the support. Probably in time for one more. Five minutes left of the of the tournament. Uh, sh uh sure, sure, uh, Jeff. Wow, I've never seen this before. Take as knight c7. We do this.
Oh, then he has 96. It's not a good idea. We can do this, maybe. That makes... That makes more sense. Takes, takes, and then... Knight b4. Probably going rook c1. Uh, I don't think he has anything better. We'll take on a2, rook c7. It's surprised by that because I think I'm uh, very like too active here. Give a check and knight g4 looks very tempting. This also looks very good actually. Immediately. Because when we take, we have uh, this maybe. Hoping for F three ninety three so we can mate. He's gonna take and play f3. I uh, regret e5 probably goes b4 now. It's still quite equal ish. Yeah, not much to do here. We gotta try. Oh, it's aborted. Oh, I. Oh, yeah, the time is over. So, the game is abandoned, I think. I'm not used to the format here. Should probably take him to draw it. Yeah, sorry, sorry, guys. That was that was a rough, rough event. I'm thinking the second time I'm playing Arena Kings. I'm uh, not used to winning games, but also. Thinking about winning fast and just playing bad, so yeah, um, I did better in Title Tuesday yesterday. <laughs> that was that was rough. That was uh, a lot of tough games. Need to step it up. Definitely need to step it up. And undeserved lunch, uh, Pan Stonky.
<sighs> Let's win a couple games first, Eric. <laughs> Can't leave it on that. Appreciate it, Langois. Really appreciate it. e4, I think you can take and go e5 here. e5, queen c5, and then move the knight, like, claiming that this bishop is a bit. e4, maybe we can take on c3. Another end game for you guys. Should be easier for black, I think, because the e4 pawn is weak. Potentially. Gets this square, but the knight on d4 is very strong. Rook b4, try to play a4. Trying to drop my rook. Gotta be. Yeah, I should have played a4 on the move before for sure. Before he got to play bishop c4. Hello, bra. Hello, big bra. That's. You should have played Arena Kings instead of me. That's. I'm. Um, uh, <laughs> I don't know if you saw some of. That's some of the worst chess I've. Do you know that I've retired? Do you know I've retired from Arena Kings? You 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 would do better than me. I I promise you. That's uh. You just have to watch the streams, uh, Aryan. Uh, there's actually evidence against your statement right there. Did you see my placements? I saw your placement, and it was easy. It was actually like easy to expect, but it was kind of hard to see your placement from down where I usually finish in that tournament. Yeah, it's kind of a weird format because I was playing like Jospem when I was <laughs> on two other than. No, but this is what this is why nobody plays the tournament. I mean, nobody like Eric and me. Because it's Cause very random who you play against, yeah. And when you're down bad and tilted, they give you like Danya or Jospem <laughs> or Bortnik. Yeah. And then you lose to one of them, and they give you the other one. You yeah, have I got to play Bortnik, like, and then 
if you're not playing well, you're gonna be playing like your worst chess and yeah. then the strongest player and then your worst chess, strongest player. It's like a nasty combo. I think everything together really made me tilt. Yeah, I strongly believe Arena Kings is simply more enjoyable for uh, weaker ratings. Like, it really is. Like a 1200 will have a more fun time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no because they what. get to play the GMs, yeah? Well, no, that's the thing. They won't play the GMs. If, but you're not getting paired against 1200s, this is the point. Oh, you know, I thought the format was like the person that finishes first uh, no. gets paired against each other. You, you know, play against like... your rating. That's why you're ah, getting paired against okay, Jocelyn. Okay. That makes sense. But it's very annoying, very tough for you. If you're not playing well, you're just getting swarmed with strong opponents. So yeah. I'm saying if you're 1300 and you're like, you know, you can fight, and you play some 1800s, you play some 800s. Makes can, more sense. Yeah, yeah, you have a much yeah. better So you time. actually get punished for your rating. That's... I think so. So if it's, I would, It's extremely tough. If I would lose a lot of rating, I would get easier pairings? Is that what you're saying, or...? Yes, but also you and me, buddy, we, uh... We don't have the best styles, you know? Lots of endgames for the yeah. boys. Yeah, it's, it's a really bad Arena King style. Jospam is ready to sack his pieces and... Go for the tactics. Go for the tactics. I don't do that, and so I'm like a terrible Arena King style. Yeah. Uh, how are you feeling? Um... I'm feeling uh, like a guy like you, top 230, <laughs> deserves food. No, I okay, think that's... I'll, uh, I'll wrap this up. You don't understand, man. I'll wrap this up. You don't understand that your performance was good. For the standards of the Arena Kings, performances in the house, you had a great I mean, tournament. Eric usually finishes top 20 at least, no? No. He can. And he'll have Arena Kings where he does well. But he'll have Arena Kings where he tilts off the face of the earth. No, I appreciate that. Uh... And if you played Arena King every week, not every week would be like this. You would have some good weeks. Eric has some fantastic weeks, so. but he has some terrible weeks too. But we just have but so I many terrible weeks, it doesn't feel good. But I lost against everyone who had a higher rating than me, basically, which was... Uh... Well, you lost against the guys uh, lower rated than you as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tempted to sack here, but it doesn't really work. He wants to go. Oh, I was gonna say we're not in Arena Kings anymore. Otherwise, Jospin would sack it, no? For sure. <laughs> yeah, I think he's gonna go D five here. Uh... I want to go e5, but now I realize that he has e4. How to get a good position against one a6? Is that what he plays? Yeah. <laughs> he tails after one game, uh, apparently. Oh. Interesting. But you're just in the pool. Post uh, AK. Yeah, pool. I just wanted to wrap no, it up I with some uh, with a couple of wins, but uh, just to I get the spirits up. Exactly. Uh, but now I've blundered. Uh... You'll never be able to end the stream, no? <laughs> Probably not, actually. We'll be here forever. No? For sure. Queen C two, Rook C one, he has D two, actually. I don't think he saw that, but. Uh... You think there's luck in chess, Ari? Like, do you For sure. Uh, you know there are some players that say there is no luck, but yeah. there's a lot of luck in chess. That's, I, I believe uh, that, yeah. Experienced players know this. But it's easy to look uh, like, you no. Know, if they hear you say, like, oh, this guy's just lucky, they'll like never now, believe you. Like now, for instance, I was very lucky, I think. <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> very unlucky, no? He's very lucky. Yeah. 
I don't think you should have traded there. It makes it makes it much easier for us. These are the positions you're very good at in bullets, like with the pre moves. Oh, like when there's uh, only one color bishop, like light squares, and so you yeah, just go yeah. opposite. Mm-hmm. game is over no should, should we take here <laughs> honestly at this point you got the most dominant position oof so nasty yeah it's hard to mess this up uh hi uh uskis how are you doing yeah no that's that's i mean the king's moves. but thanks for making me feel better i mean no but i'm not even just saying it like i truly we don't play it that much because it's so brutal. Pairings are so nasty. You're having bad Some of the games I was losing, I was like, I was yeah. struggling to beat 2200s. I know, I know what you mean. It feels insane that it's possible, but it's possible. And it doesn't just happen. To and you. then we're on chess TV, so many people, it's hard to, <laughs> hard to not feel. <laughs> no, I get very tilted from this tournament, so I just don't play it. Oh, okay. That's... So when you you don't play TT, you don't play Arena Kings. Yeah, even TT is tough, like... <laughs> but Arena Kings is... Just no. Just no. That's why you uh, said this morning you wanted to play. So, okay. Yeah, no, I only played once before. The first time I played it went better than this, but still, of course, I, I was not... I think I was maybe top 50, but... Mm -hmm. uh, Which is a good result. Yeah, this very was very decent. No, I uh, I wouldn't uh, beat yourself up about this. Really, it's a nasty tournament. Nasty. But you know, yeah. in the no, I actually I actually didn't know it's matters your ra your rating matters for your opponents. I thought it's like you know, uh, Leech just had this format like uh, whoever finishes first get paired against each other. So it doesn't really the timing of the game that finishes uh, is what matters. In, that's right. In terms of your pairing. So. And there are some tournaments like that on chess.com, but it's just, uh, yeah, not this one. <laughs> mm. Not this one. So it's pretty nasty. Yeah, getting. Thank you, Kilimanjaro. Wow, thanks for the 10 gifted uh, subs. To make you feel better. Bro. I don't deserve it, but. I'm Maybe honest, 10, I'm honest, uh, yeah. 10 subs for 10 wins? Did you get 10 wins in two hours? Maybe uh, not. No? For sure. I think so. You can see just there. In Arena Kings? I mean, with, two, with these two games, I did for sure. But Games? Archive? Yeah, you can oh. just count. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, no, no, wait. Eight is bullet. That's a bullet game. Oh. Yeah, start counting after that. Okay, one, two. Are we counting these two? Uh, let's start from the bottom and start counting from Arena Kings. Okay. Uh, was Bach your first win in Arena Kings? Wait. Yeah, I think so. Because you had a draw. Okay. So. Yeah, Bach was my first win. One, two... Should we show the browser, by the way? One, two, three, mm -hmm. four, mm -hmm. five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> Nine wins, no? Very lucky, no? <laughs> but we actually have to give back, no? We owe him a sub. What? We owe him a sub, man. We owe him a sub. We're in debt to Kilimanjaro. Oh my god. It's crazy to think about. <laughs> I probably... How many did I lose? One, two, three... Four, five, six... Actually, I felt I lost more than six games, but... Seven. I lost... We're... Oh, that's also... Yeah, I lost 2-0 to Kamsky, and I was so... 
But Tough the, gifts. The, the thing with this format, right, is a draw feels this, like a loss. Actually, because this, it ruins this your was streak. the worst game. I mean, I don't know. This I'm, was a bad pre-move, yeah? Yeah. Very disturbing pre-move by you. And the second I was about to remove it, he played King G7. Has it happened to me before? You're trying to remove a pre-move? Yeah, exactly. yeah, definitely. But most of the time... Uh... What do you think with three seconds less, who is in my favorite here? Because I have one more pawn or not? Probably am, yeah? Uh, very hard to say, honestly. Like, if, uh, you, have, if you ask like, the fastest, most talented, like, like Danya or something, which side he would rather be? Maybe black? Really? I don't know. Because I don't he know has what to the be, answer is. Oh, he's careful about the rook traits, right? Definitely. But both sides have to be careful about the rooks being put like where they can yeah. capture. Yeah. I feel like if black just like keeps the rook near. I don't know. Yeah, probably the answer is that white's a bit favorite. But if, it's only if you can trade the pawn. If you can trade the pawn, then white's I think, a big favorite. Mm. Yeah, I guess if, it, if it's like 5 seconds against 8, black is a huge favorite for sure, but because it's huge. 13, 16, it's... Yeah, yeah. yeah. but it's close. Uh, obviously, a strong guy could win easily with both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, soon I'll have to show you my uh, openings, Aryan. My, uh, I definitely want to try my garbage in, openings uh, uh, because then... On Tuesday and Arena Kings. Then, then when you're play. down bad, like uh, having a bad event, then you can feel more comfortable playing them. Honestly, it was, you know? not, it was not like my openings were uh, <laughs> pay, paying, off, paying off well <laughs> anyway, but yeah. Uh. Oh yeah, by the way, we have... Uh, I think I can update this HelloFresh. Um, Because we got some more signups, Aryan, that weren't uh, that weren't recorded. Oh really? We're, yeah, we're up to fifteen now. Or you you actually got more signups than uh, the counter was indicating, which was, you know, not uh, not fair. There, they weren't showing. People are doing everything to make me feel better. Yeah. Oh, so we're missing the new one is fourteen. We got one, yeah, or. Uh, yeah, we're at 14 now, exactly. Okay. So we're missing 1 to 15. They're gonna see you play chess, That's uh, and it will, and it will come, bro. How do you feel, Arian? Are you and J-Man gonna get some food? I, I'll get some, I'll get some food. Have you had food? Do you I have to get you anything? Uh, I'm okay, because I think you guys are uh, going to, well, at least considering Subway, uh, I'm boycotting Subway. No subway for the no boys. Subway. No. Okay. I remember in Reykjavik, me and you were having subway together in 2019. Yep. I think my boycott started in uh, Calgary. So that would be, yeah, about 2020. Yeah. So 2020. that was for the uh, boxing match or? Boxing match was pretty recent. Yeah, but I mean like you, when you were not, uh, you were careful about what you were eating before that, right? You think I was training for Trent since 2020? No, the 2022 was actually... Oh, yeah, 2020 is too... But 2022 oh. in December. Yeah, yeah, and you knew about it only one year before? Uh, only a couple months. Oh, only a couple of months. Four, four or five months, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> think I was training for Trent with you, buddy, at, at Subway? I thought it was your life goal, no? To, <laughs> you were training your whole life. Everybody should be training in case they have to fight Trent, no? Yeah, it's a big uh, probability. You should be training now, no? It's a big probability. <laughs> no, I boycott Subway because I just don't, don't like the, uh, the food. It hasn't, I haven't seen Subway come out with anything new in like 10 years, maybe that's, 20 years. That's probably true. But I do see McDonald's and like these other ones coming up with some new like burger. Like Subway has just been the same stuff for a while. Yeah, it's just that it's more healthy than Ma McDonald's, but it's, yeah, I mean, they're, they're not good at introducing new, I mean, they have some new shops, but, um, yeah. The so, only subs I'm interested in are right here on Twitch, uh, buddy, you know, 
Thanks. Makes sense. Makes sense. These, these are the subs I care about. All right, you want to take over? Yep. Well, uh, see you guys soon. Thanks for thanks for all the support. I'll, uh... Really, don't yeah. feel too bad. The, <laughs> I'm sure people enjoyed watching you suffer a really? little bit. A little <laughs> bit. That was. Uh, I felt very embarrassed during the during the play. But... It's actually such a tough tournament. Like, don't uh, yeah. worry. <laughs> as, as, I as I said yesterday, I'm usually very self-critical about my own play, so I'm, I don't think I'm just supposed to lose like that. But yeah, that's, the format is different. I'll I'll get used to it. Mm -hmm. Okay, buddy. See you, uh, Ryan. See you. See you around. See you. Uh, Mattis, unfortunately, I can't, you know. Against, uh, Chess.com, TOS. Can't be, uh, boosting anyone's accounts. Opening ceremony should be later tonight, BWS. I think like uh, at 7 p.m. I've certainly not MC. Uh, in fact, definitely not. No chance. I was uh, Aryan and AK. Man, it's such a such a brutal event. Like, you just, you feel a little bit bad for whoever's playing. Just feels like a funeral. You're just watching someone down, down on their luck. It's the opening ceremony at the pub chess bar. That's some funny stuff. But... Honestly, very valid question, considering they did the drawing of lots there. Um, but speaking of, it is pub chess tonight, right? It is Wednesday, so. Arena Kings is much tougher than candidates. If Magnus joined Arena Kings, I'm convinced he would not win it. Twink time, thanks for the 46 months. Thanks for the AK support, everybody. I see Val was, was here checking in. Yeah, 928. Hello, Feeler. I'm not sure. I think a few people will be there, uh, Mr. 002. But we have the opening ceremony tonight, so... If it happened, it would be later, you know? Peace, budge. <laughs> if any of the candidates go, that would be funny. I will be at the opening ceremony, yes. Let's see what the day list is offering us. Psy Trance Techno Rave Wednesday afternoon. God damn. Okay, it's a rave Wednesday afternoon, apparently.
We gotta change our uh, title here. Arena Kings is over. Very over. We had a fun cooking stream yesterday. I don't know who caught that, but there may be more of that. Oh, was there a, uh, was there developments in that Kramnik, uh, playing on someone else's account stuff? Or is this, uh, this is, uh, real, right? Dude, you always have to tread carefully with, uh, information close to April 1st. Both players have been notified that they are suspended from prize events on chess.com. Kramnik for three months and his Matulin indefinitely. Why not both indefinitely? Do you think they should both be three months? Or do you think they should both be indefinitely? Yeah, I don't really know who stood to benefit from this relationship, if anyone. So I'm not really sure. <laughs> what the situation is. But definitely Kramnik could only have played on his account if he permitted it. So, yeah, I don't know. It seems honestly worse that Kramnik did it than... <laughs> the other guy isn't it sort of like you make the conscious decision to play on someone else's account you're more liable as the one actually doing it than the guy who's like oh you can use my account <laughs> that's pretty much all this guy did <laughs> Is that, but is that actually a, a thing, Mac? It sounds plausible for sure. You wanted to play on someone else's account to see if they're just cheating against him? But Rum Biscuit, won't you just say if you're caught that, uh, won't you just say that it was a joke or a troll? That doesn't make much sense, right? If you're doing it as a joke, then it should be treated differently and less seriously if you're doing it with serious intentions. I mean, won't you just claim that it was a joke? <laughs> like the YouTube pranksters, like... <laughs> yeah, but... We're talking about prize money events, right? People are, you know, for example, the Chesper account is an account where it's known that it's not always the same people on there, but we can't play a money event with the Chesper account. 
That's never been a thing. We have uh, a, a Valentinian using the chess bra account at one point. You know what I mean? Obviously, we mostly just play uh, play with the chat. People know what they're getting into, unrated games, whatever. And, of course, there's privileges for people that are streaming because it's, you know, a little bit easier and facilitates content to just have a general account that when people visit, they can play on. But to compete in, like, a prize money event, especially, like, where it matters the most, because, like, if I'm playing Ismatulin, I might know his openings or I might have played him before, multiple games and so i'm like prepared for that type of game and then i just get something completely different like it's definitely could be a serious advantage there how did they get caught how did these idiots get caught tim uh kramnik said that he did it <laughs> that's how these idiots got caught <laughs> <laughs> no but he didn't say that he did it as an admission he said that he did it probably unaware that you couldn't do it So yeah, I don't know much about this, but that's definitely funny. Of course, dripping with irony. Was he at his house? Well, this guy obviously let him play, so what? You just give your login, you can play from anywhere, right? Didn't realize Title Tuesday was a prize event. You think the top 200 titled players in the world gather every Tuesday for no reason? <laughs> yeah, just to grow the game. You get $1,000 for winning it. And remember, there's two Title Tuesdays per day that it occurs. So it's like, <laughs> it's quite a lot of attempts in a month. Eight Title Tuesdays, $8,000. If you're proficient at winning these, not only is it good practice, but there's uh, some serious coin on the line. Plus, they just made that titled cop or whatever thingy, which is makes, I think there's even more money on the line. Does placing on the podium make money? Yes. There's first, second, and third prizes. Yeah, Title Cup is like just the exact same thing, but actually tallying the overall scores in Title Tuesdays. So to reward you even more for playing a lot of Title Tuesdays. Yeah, and obviously, I don't know about a living, but Hikaru makes a very good, like, reliable chunk of uh, change because he's just so good at, at that event. But yeah, a potential of like $8,000 a month just off TT. I mean, it's really not bad. Really not bad at all. Run, you've seen it. Yeah, the venue looks nice. I'm excited for things to get underway. Opening ceremony tonight. Candidates underway tomorrow with the fan zone.
dress code at the candidates. Same as normal, I guess. Like, there's always dress code at uh, official FIDE events. If you're talking about the players. If you're talking about people attending the fan zone, there's most certainly not a dress code. Uh, as I assume it will be broken by every second entrant. There's no games today, no. Yeah, I mean, you gotta be compassionate towards Buddy Ubitsia. Come on now, we want him to have a good time. I guess this is happening. Taking here is probably a move, not like completely insane. I don't know. <laughs> this looks pretty stupid, but maybe we can just put that in there. Okay, he's going to give the material back. Maybe that's smart. I guess we should take it. Hey, what's up, champ? Good to see you, buddy. Oh, champ. What lines can we open up here? <laughs> Do we have anything? I feel like knight d4 a6 is maybe okay. I don't know. Go F6. F5, maybe we can take. Get the queen in. For now, he can't push because of that. Right here we can take that. Ooh, okay, I didn't see that. So we're gonna go all the way back, sadly. At least we have an open diagonal here. I think that was a good pawn sack. I don't know. We're kind of playing for stuff here now. Rook G3 doesn't work, I think. So sad. So sad. Ooh. Didn't expect that. Ouch.
oh my god. This guy's actually so bad. I was playing on, like, kind of trolling. I can't believe he didn't win. I've got to be the worst player I've ever seen. <laughs> How do you not win that? What? There's no way. 22 seconds to 6.5? You have to be trolling. <laughs> this might be the actual most unexpected comeback that I've ever had in a chess game. This is crazy. 11 seconds to 4.3. 6 to 3. I don't know. But then here, it's like, I thought I was actually pretty clever here. Usually they don't expect you to go back this way. Okay, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You've lost worse? I believe that. But this guy's a 2800 IM. Who knows how close he is to GM. Like, those positions are nothing at that level to handle. Damn. Okay. I would be very tilted after that as well, you know, understandably. That's crazy. Should have played this last turn, of course. And F7. Uh, B6, Queen C2. Like, I guess we go here. I really don't want to trade. This isn't mate. He has this. Didn't see that one. He resigned in a position where it's almost equal. So we'd love to see that. <laughs> love to see that. I don't know if I should play d6 and let that happen, but let's do this for now. Not sure why we did that one. We need g6 or h6 here.
Queen d7. My guy. I, I didn't expect it. They don't know what to do here. Let's put the rook here. It's a nice square. To be honest, we should take there probably. We want him to play e5, I think, so we have the outside pawn. Yeah. Obviously, I'm not winning and I'm down on time but you know you always have to assume uh, that you're playing for a win so even though it might be a blessing in disguise we might have lost I'm still upset to have repeated normally it's not that scary because you can just oppose that bishop with this one Ninety four. I mean, the queen on h three is really bad. It's not really doing anything. I was actually gonna take, uh, but I have to do it this way. Now that square's covered as well. Queen c three hits everything. Uh. Queen d2 hits everything. It's rook e8, though. So. It's fine. Then on g3 is also really bad. Oh, wow. Ha! <laughs> I didn't see that. I guess we'll guard the pawn. Uh, man. Hey, Bortnik! We have a different, different representative here this time. Thanks for the raid. I think you played uh, Buddy Aryan in AK. Thanks a lot. Almost 700 people. Really appreciate that. Candidates are getting this, uh, started this week and that's pretty much all that's on our plate. We're hosting a live fan zone. Uh, 
haven't been focused on this game. We have a really tough position here. Okay, it just got a bit better. Just got a bit better. This is too much, right? Knight g4, we're hurting. Maybe we survive. I think we lose a piece somehow. I think bishop takes f3 was good enough there. And No trades for me, eh? Bishop F5. Actually, take. Pawn takes rook F6. We should be able to go here. Uh, he might do that, but he's losing the pawn anyway. Thanks for the gifted sub, uh, Lyosh. Very kind of you, sir. Okay. B6, most important move in the position. Going after this one. Strange. I needed uh, to catch, like, yeah. Needed to catch some move there. Like, cover a square he was maybe going to go to. I think that's the only way. When you're that down on time and trying to mate, I don't think you're ever going to succeed in mating, so. Okay, what's going on here? Yeah, this feels like theory. I hate that stuff. I guess. I guess F5? I don't know. Let him have it. Knight on f5 actually 
looks like a reasonable piece and I think there's a world where we trade everything. I think it got some speed. We have one second. Dude, I'm like, I'm out of it, clearly. <laughs> not, not even capable of playing bullet right now. <laughs> At least let me go play someone higher rated. I can tell what bullet mood I'm in, and it's not the speedy kind. So I may as well play someone that I'm not going to get destroyed elo-wise. My first chess games of the day. Feeling very sluggish. Played those moves in the wrong order. <laughs> At least the losses are not as bad. Damn. Damn. 
I wouldn't have resigned that, that's for sure. I feel that that almost always works. Just like going back with the bishop after h6 and then immediately taking. I win a piece a lot doing that. Guess we'll take this way. I'm not sure about that, to be honest. Okay, never mind. It's fine now. Ooh, uh oh. Yeah, probably uh, better to draw. We would lose, of course. Oh, it's really bad timing on that. Okay, I'll give that pawn back for a very compact position here. I feel like we've played like a hundred times this exact same position. This is not bad. Thank you, Dale.
so silly. Did rook f6 just like we wanted. That's pretty rare. The king e5, uh, discovered attack. Okay, have to make some predictions there. Oh, dude, what the? Maybe we can meet him? We did beat him into that checkmate there. That's this is the definition of unlucky. You're wondering if there's luck in chess. We were definitely behind there. 
I think he's playing this to get an idea of how to play against it. Okay. G5 is a really bad move. We have queen e5 check. I mean, only we should be better. was a game we were always going to lose. When he played h4 and took on d4, we were just cooked there. Outside pass bond should be quite good. Long F6 was also no good. I'm not playing these very well. Uh, it's not good. <laughs> uh, get it any way you can here.
D3 is hanging there as well. Really bad move. I'll take, I'll give up the exchange. Uh, like, just getting super unlucky. Oh no, it's not this. Are we gonna lose? Uh, barely alive here. Lagging like crazy. MC9008, thanks for the 10 subs. Oh yeah, I forgot. I can't even accept the rematch. Steve G999, thanks for the seven months. You live by the sword, die by the sword. In those time scrambles. Whoa. Huh? Okay. <laughs> what the heck was that? MC, what numbers were you uh, running up? I saw you wrote something to Tim in the chat. I wasn't streaming at the time. Some poker numbers. Sounds like there's been some success lately. Always feel inclined to ask. As I know, these are these subs are a direct result of success. You think um, chess.com OG layout? Is that it? Is that what I'm missing? I hope you're right. That kind of uh, that kind of excites me. Yeah, I thought you were saying um, something about uh, what you turned your stack into. Or your bankroll into. But I'm, I might be misremembering. Daco67, thanks for the seven months with Prime.
Butte was AKs in the Discord. I did see that. Always like to see the uh, success. But yeah, I did. I did read that in the Discord. Live is uh, very close, fish. Remember chess.com live? That doesn't exist. Alan, you're uh, talking to someone here that can fluctuate hundreds in a session. So I get it. Are we sharing poker stories? I guess I started it. Feels so slow after all those 30 second games. Yeah, G5. All right. And it starts tomorrow, so nothing on the cards till then. Uh, not sure about this. Sure, he should do that. No doubt in my mind. Decides to take. Okay. I'm going to go here, actually. Probably should have done that last turn.
Rookie four. His pawns look quite bad, but because it's a rook end game, it won't be as bad as you think. It just won't be as bad as you think. Okay, I really like covering a5. I feel like if he plays a5, his position really improves. I wish he would play e4. Mr. Willie Hammer. Thanks for the five month reset. A little Bishop d3? No. F3. F3, eh? Might be some Night G4 stuff. Okay. Not after that move, that's for sure. Feels like a bishop should be there. Thanks, fine. Brian gifting us up to Queen Trap. Wow. Rook eight. Really want to play a knight g4 move. It's just. Can't sack just yet. G six looks uh, pretty useful as well. Okay, d4, and I guess d4 doesn't do anything just yet. I'm thinking of it. Here, d4, I feel like there's lots of threats now. I might just sack, like I would do that, honestly. <laughs> Bishop on b6 is so strong.
Well, the event starts uh, expedition today, right? Of course, the event starts today because there's an opening ceremony, but no games is all. I don't even know if winning this uh, material is the best, but that's what we're going to do. Pieces are a little bit strange. Mm. I guess Rook here is solid. King is really safe on e7 and whatnot. Yeah, takes takes c5, knight d7, and, and finally we're solid, and maybe you can play for a win. I'll also trade that bishop as well. Ah, queen c6. Ah, literally the second we, uh, the second we pre move. Hey, <laughs> pretty unlucky. Because even if we catch, I would say even if we catch that, we could win. Uh, we're, we're behind, but uh, sometimes you can just shuffle the pieces. Should be four is crazy. What's that? No way this is acceptable.
Bruh. Hey, dude. What's going? Oh, just uh, blitzing. What are you up to? Oh, I just had some. Some Subway? Yes. Your favorite. It makes some people happy. I like it for that. It's easy. I mean, it's not best quality food, but I mean. Easy is good for you. If you want something fast, not too unhealthy, I feel Subway is not a bad option. Uh, I mean, it's like much better than getting pizza or McDonald's. I'm, it's not very healthy, but it's not unhealthy. Quick. Also, it's so close to your house, so. Mm. I like your position a lot. Well, uh, wait till you see what I'm about to do to it. Bishop on d5 is saying hello. Oh, thanks, Dill. Oh, thanks. Liquidating the advantage. It's okay. Just easier to play fast when the <laughs> queen is. It's easier to play fast in a worse position, no? <laughs> I mean, I mean, always with the queens off. I like if you're low on time. I don't think it's stupid because you can play play faster. It's easier to get some quick ones in. We liked that he's uh, thinking. Nice. Mm, very risky. Very risky. Yeah, I think you had to do that. Hmm. Tough. Nice. You're faster than you can do this. It's actually not bad though. It's <laughs> yeah, you're catching up. Nice. Kyo. Kyo. Let's go. No, 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 but that was amazing. You had one minute less. You had 30 seconds, you had one thirty. And uh, the speed is... I wish I had your speed, but... I really well, I've, I've sacrificed... I mean, you uh, had four seconds against 15 at some point, and... I sacrificed two 200 ELO for that speed. But yeah. that Rook C6 was very funny that he used the bottom of the yeah. <laughs> And Rook C6 was actually not so bad. Yeah. It was the best move in the posi position, no? Practically best move, no? <laughs> yeah. 
That's no, funny. you had a good position there. The only problem was that you were low, <laughs> low on time. But uh, H4, H5, you were taking over. <laughs> Rook C6. Yeah, I think E6 was too much before. It's the best pre-move, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it put it out. How much time did you spend after Rook C6? Okay, only one second. Well, because it looks like a blunder. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but actually, Rook C6, Rook C6 wasn't... Yeah, E6 yeah. was too ambitious. I I think so, yeah. But you maybe forgot about Knight D8. I mean, Knight C6 is a yeah. bit of a yeah, more obvious yeah. move. If there's any way, like, hard here with 30 seconds less. But you were so much faster than him that you always had chances. Yeah. Cheers, are you? Cheers, you deserve it. Yeah, great point, Chess Ninja. Aryan's too humble. He's got a big uh, 3167 bullet rating, talking about wishing he had my speed. I'm very curious if Amon thinks I can hold that rating. <laughs> Depends against After who. After seeing my... Uh, Depends against who, though. You know, so obviously there are some guys where I would say at that rating, they'd love to play you because they might take some rating, but against other guys, you'll probably farm. Like, I think Daniel wants to play me. Who? Daniel? Dan Daniel. He wants to farm me with that rating. But not at 2900, no? Then he won't play you. No, I mean, at the, at the bullet rating. That's what I mean. Three, but yeah. if you were 2900, yeah, yeah, maybe course. he wouldn't want to play. Yeah. You're usually around 3000 or? Yeah, these days. Yeah. That's where usually, like, I would, I don't know. I haven't played much, so I definitely, I'm probably not good for 3170, but uh, it, yeah, it depends who you're playing against. Yeah, it depends like who you're against and where they are. Like, you might be playing someone who's usually 3000, but they're at 3100 now, so even if the, the match doesn't go your way, like, it's just good. It's a good idea to play them. Good yeah, value. It's what we talked about yesterday. Who is at her peak? Who is not yeah, at her peak? Exactly. Uh, exactly like that. Skatey Barra, thanks for the 13 months. Er, oh, oh, 002, thanks for the Prime. Uncondescending, eight months with Prime as well. Uh, yeah, Nero Chess. Yeah, I do have my own channel on Twitch, but I, I streamed like for two months in the summer of 2020. Uh, when COVID Long time hit. ago. Holy Long time ago, like yeah. Four that years was now. When, when COVID hit, but uh, I haven't been streaming on my own channel since. Only been streaming for, for the brass. I played Do you this play, guy. You play a lot of 30 second chess in general, or? I played this guy a lot. I think he's a kid. I started a match 03 against him or something. I was doing really poorly, and then the match ended eventually, like, I don't know, 40 to 6 or something. 40 to 6 is uh, a crazy score. Big score for a big guy. Mr. D3. Masterclass. You no? like to trap knights. Big masterclass. Just don't do like J Bell, yeah? I'm going for mates. <laughs> oh my god. We have more time, so you cannot you're, lose. You're, no? you're, you're, a man of, you're a man of experience. You, you know what you're doing. <laughs> Nice. It's such a nice position to play with no time for wins. Oh, nice. Nice and easy. You said you beat him 46. Did you adopt him in that process at some point? Or? I think so. But at the start, I was uh, worried it wouldn't be a good match at all.
I really like Bishop takes D3 there. Practical move. Very no? practical. So good at these hand games. Wow. <laughs> Made against Bishop. Yeah, but before that, it wasn't easy. <laughs> Actually, I tried to play Bishop F6, but I couldn't because the Queen was there. Only reason I saw it. Otherwise, I would have missed it, no? Oh. Must be winning, no? But I'll probably lose it. No, 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 no. Must be played. <laughs> no, it is. It's good. Mold again. Model move forcing the king uh, to h6. Very impressive. Nice. <laughs> Back to 3k soon. Not anymore, no? Ah, uh, It's a friendly move. Just when I said that. Smelling uh, an adoption. I was just talking about how uh, my favorite strats is to go back bishop h4 and then take. Because I don't expect it, right? Usually win a piece like a lot of the yeah. time. Are you one of those guys who play like bishop h6 in the opening to try to? No, I actually get people know I get annoyed by those players. You get annoyed by it? Yeah. It's quite sturdy. Oof. That was unlucky, that was really unlucky. You couldn't expect to things before there. It's okay. Oh. it's okay, don't worry. Oh! Our rook takes b4 there was very unexpected. So that, but that's what I mean. Those are the nasty moves, like... But he was lucky because I, I, don't, I don't think he actually saw that your rook was protecting. Uh, but he just got away with that. I don't play them um, that much, but okay, in a time scramble, like at the very end, obviously anything can uh, can happen. But no, I, I, I really don't play many uh, dirty moves. Some of my dirtiest moves have been an accident. Like I'll slip something, <laughs> blunder my queen. This is 
impossible to hold. Uh, he doesn't need uh, my help, Janur. I'm, I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning the speed from. You're 31. <laughs> Friendly. Friendly. You play some OTB tournaments a month. You played in Florida a couple of months ago, or? That was not for a tournament. We were there uh, with chess.com and Magnus was there. Did you mean that trip? Ah, okay. okay. There was no chess uh, happening there.
this. Man. Back to 3k. Let's go. Where's the adoption? Maybe we get to I'm do not my... I'm gonna jinx it this time. Yeah, you see? <laughs> Bishop h4 and then... You know what you're doing. You have... Uh... <laughs> it's... Uh, Bishop h4 to f6 is a high level trap. I really liked f6. Another pass pawn for the boys. Three passers. That's nine. Wow. Is it? Yeah. I'm pretty sure. You're counting. Yo. That's a really deserved KO. That was some very nice games. Very nice count. Back to back to 3K. Oh, uh, oh, you really downed that, eh? Jeez. Uh, it's very nice. Easier to drink when it's, you're not playing. Eh? It's harder <laughs> to drink when you have 30 <laughs> seconds on the clock. <laughs> Well counted. No, I mean, Aryan could have said the wrong number there and the whole match could have been different. <laughs> you need a guy that can keep count. I can still count somehow. It's a but, uh, protein shake, MC. Fruit shake. No, Knowing how many months, how many years is uh, 68 months, like this, 16 months is harder. Oh. That's a deserved sub for you. Latinium Bond. Thanks. Thank you, buddy Latinum. One sub per win. Aryan uh, still owes a sub to uh, I definitely do. Kilimanjaro. I definitely do, yeah. Thanks, Latinum Blonde. Yeah, it was great to, uh, great to meet you. We'll see you at the fan zone, of course, but... Thanks for coming by, man. That was a lot of fun. It was a good night to come by because we had the Hello Fresh going. I feel like we had so much random stuff happening. It was nice to meet you yesterday, man. Prime, Itachi, 22 months. Thank you. Thank you. Venomous Vader. Keo Hype, two months, tier two. Very unusual, tier two. We have tier threes, we have tier ones, but. Honestly, maybe tier two is the new uh, coolest tier. Very memorable. Colby, yeah, I'm visiting for the candidates and seeing, seeing the boys again, hanging out. Mm -hmm. uh, doing the fan zone at the venue, starting from tomorrow. Amon will also be there. <laughs> Are you visiting for anything special? No, just happened to be here, no? Yeah, <laughs> randomly. <laughs> just at the time of the candidate. Just came by from Norway to say hi, no? Crazy. Crazy timing. I have a... Uh, I'm hoping... Let me see. This account. Hmm. 
Mattis, uh, yeah, a picture with Aryan would do well for anybody. I'm gonna switch uh, accounts here. Maybe we can show Aryan our uh, openings. I need to learn some new openings. Uh, oh, uh, that's, that's for sure. I've got some good ones uh, for you, buddy. You're like me, forgetting your password. I think it might be, uh... Because it's a speedrun account, so it might be like a password that's not actually one of my usual passwords, you know what I mean? Yep. Um... Oh, hello, Wild Hacks. Hey, Fractal. Yeah, Fractal is, uh... You still, uh, chilling, you're, you're still chilling in Argentina, Wild Hacks? What are your days looking like there? Did you meet any ladies? Hope to, hope to see you during candidates, man. A few ladies, he says. Modest, no? Didn't expect anything, anything else from you. Ah. Glad to hear you're enjoying. There we go. There we go. I need to play, uh... I think it's been a while since I played on um, on the account, so I think if Which we is that Al Al Albania? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Your buddy Drake was doing a an Albanian song Have you been recently. There before? I haven't. One of the few places, but they had the club club. Yeah. So yeah, we were missing you there. So even you've been, and. Uh, I think they're hosting another, like cadets or something. Like basically, you can tell they have a venue that they're getting some deal at because they're hosting more things there. It was now. nice there. I liked it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, was it like the, the, by the beach or what? Yeah. Well, the hotel it was like a resort next to the beach, so you were a bit like outside of the city. Didn't really get to see much, but that area mm -hmm. around the hotel was uh, a pleasant place to be with some nice restaurants. Mm -hmm. and Weather was good. Only thing I didn't like was the dogs. There were a lot of uh, stray, yeah, home, like ho homeless, rabid dogs, ho homeless dogs that were. Uh, one of them bit Magnus, so, <laughs> so he had to get the treat treatment for that <laughs> on the last day of the celebration. Because this is my a team won the event. Big new move for you. One of them. Yeah. It's a new move for you. Of course, dealing with knight c3 with bishop d6. Yeah. Knight. Yeah. I like the concept. No, we get... Uh, okay, well, we're here anyway. Yeah, yeah, because bishop g5... Yeah, it's yeah, very strange. I'll take the bishop, probably. Try this. Of course, bishop there will be nice if we can make it happen. This is a very nice position. Usually, we get decent position when we play this, huh? Yeah. Yeah, to be honest. Bishop e3. We still want to play bishop g4. Uh, just anyway. C3 for sure, but no. Yeah, Amon was talking about that earlier. Uh, zero X. He played on his uh, pal's account. Yeah, yeah, I was talking about it earlier. That's right. <laughs> Funny. Funny Vlad. In a tournament, in a serious tournament.
Hmm. It's gonna be a bit wrong, actually. Ah, oh, I think it's fine. Here, here. So I think we have to take this. Man of five is saying hello with Queen E5. <laughs> Not really sure if this is good. I thought Knight C4 was uh, strong. Super strong. <laughs> Extremely strong. They're still good though. We're gonna have to deal with the nasty, nasty Knight F5, eh? Nasty, nasty square. Oof. So painful. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> that's a problem. I don't think he saw knight d3, but uh, no, rook d1. Lucky, no? <laughs> yeah, rook d1 just went right. <laughs> lucky. <laughs> knight g5 is nice. D6 is a genius. <laughs> that is for boys. Some genius. He knows something we don't. Yeah. Some genius maneuvering there. You know, I would play rook takes D6 there and blunder my rook. And, <laughs> and I run the keys. Big help. Safe pre move. Yeah, for sure. Even knight d2 wasn't stopping that. Exactly. <laughs> That's why I was thinking the same thing. So I'm curious what's the most annoying way, in your opinion, uh, that White can play up with queen f6? Maybe like this. <laughs> uh, well, it depends. Because, of course, if you like maybe take a supercomputer, you could find a way to play very aggressive. Like sack a pawn, but. Like d4 stuff? Or, mm. or like knight d5 and castle or something. Mm. But I think the, the most likely. That does happen a lot is more like this, this stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I still want to play this, this and this. What do you exactly do after, let's say, castle? You play bishop c5, right? And then yeah. c3, you go 97. Yeah. Because it's just like. Yeah. D4, yeah. When you're D4, thinking about D4 it. D4 isn't really. It seems like you can't get it. Can you go like rook e1? Try to play d4 e5. Yeah, I, th I think I can't remember if I throw this one in or not, mm -hmm. but also. Uh, after this, can sometimes wait with the bishop. Like maybe play h6, bishop back. Yeah, yeah, it's not the end of the world if he goes d5 or something. Mm -hmm. Just move the knight and then the bishop on b6 is. Yeah. How did you come up with the queen f6? Was it like. Yeah. It didn't have a name. It's like one of the. But you just thought about it one game and then you played it? or? 
No, I was sitting like analyzing, like mm. on the analysis board, thinking about how I can make up something brand new. It's because very I want creative. I've never seen it before. Because I want to call it the Hamilton defense. That's can, why. Can, how do you apply for actually making an opening uh, after your name? Well, I've already named it. <laughs> it's done. It's, it's done. done. It's done. So, yeah. so on chess space, if I put this uh, <laughs> moves, it will come down there, the Hamilton variation. I hope so. The Hamilton defense. Hamilton defense, correct. Chilling Toad, thanks for the three months. And McDermott, thanks for the 49. Okay, we don't have a special opening against Wait, this. But that's E5, E0. Yeah, other than the, the one you already know. This one's not called the Jerome. Oh, this is Anglo Gamma, though. I used to play all the time with bishop takes e5. Probably uh, nobody guy. even knows this, but I was just watching like random Twitch streams at like 3 a.m. and there was nobody streaming. And there was one dude who was streaming with like one viewer. <laughs> and like I clicked in his piece set and color of the board, everything was completely insane. Like it hurt my eyes to look at. But he was playing this line and he was like, oh yeah, like the undefeated, like yeah, I think Mon Hamilton plays this. And he always plays uh, bishop takes uh, e5, but this guy played knight takes e5. And then I was like, it's exactly what happened in this game. I was like, knight e5? How does it make sense? But rook b3. And then rook e3 and I was like, oh, this guy's a noob. Like, he's just losing the game. And then he played d6, he was blitzing. D6. Bishop b6, and then f5, and I was like... <laughs> genius. I was like, he's a genius. <laughs> and he could be like 800 elo or something. I don't even know who it is. Wow. But the only reason I even started to play he's knight been, takes e5 was because of this he's been random guy. He's been studying England Gambit theory, yeah? <laughs> wow. It's nice to take inspiration from everyone. Knight here, back, and then and I really castle. like your position. Winning, no? Yeah. Of course we can...
I have to go here. That's actually very important. We should be careful. I just get the points. That's. Maybe he won't see it as well. I don't think he has seen it, honestly. It's, it's <laughs> not so easy. I mean, I haven't seen the team before. Yeah, it's very and, weird. No, I have never seen the team Bishop before. G1 to play E3 and me. That's very pretty. Queen B4. Doesn't really stop it, though. Yeah, right? it's Queen F4, but still just, nothing. Uh, maybe, yeah. he had, maybe he has seen it after all, uh, considering his time. And you know, even if rook d4 to eventually stop it, yeah, I feel like he did see it. This doesn't really do anything about it though. Yeah, he's gonna go, go here. Oh. Still. It's impressive. I guess we have to go here. Yeah, just uh, the time. <laughs> it's very impressive he saw it. Stream sniping. Impressive, no? I mean, very impressive. It, was, it was very impressive. I, I didn't see Rook B2, he but he really did see it, which was like crazy. It's for sure the only move, right? I think so. Oh, yeah, Rook D7. Ah, okay, okay. Then you get the D1 square. Okay. He honestly might have not have seen it, but just Rook D2 to play Rook B2 because he wanted to. It's very yeah. impressive. Yeah, yeah. But otherwise, if you don't see it, I feel like you would just trade and do something. But the opening was really. But okay, we this nice. opening is kind of whatever. We've seen it, you know? Like, uh, you know about it. So hopefully we can get some real have, ones. Do you have some ideas for white other e4, e5? Tons. Tons of ideas, Aryan. Which one do you want to see? You know, the... I, I know you like to take on f7 in one of them. Yes. Definitely. Uh, Here's a big idea for you. You ever seen that? I've seen it somewhere, but I never uh, started it. Because I think there's... What happens there's, if black takes on e4? Because there's... D4 takes knight d5. Uh, okay. This is the Belgrade gambit. Knight d5, where you played it, is the Belgrade or d4? No. Okay. D4 and knight d5 is. This, I don't think, is anything. Uh, but what happens if black takes on e4? Then you go d4, takes, and you're in the Belgrade gambit, but, ah, but, but they've taken on e4. And I think the best move for black in the Belgrade is knight b4. Oh, so okay. you kind of trick them a bit, like, then they're forced to be in this 94 line, which is not as nice. So it's a clever move order. I think so. And if they don't go into it, then of course, you have just like the normal, normal stuff. And this position is actually quite I mean, you're all, nice yeah, for white. Like, you're, you're better. Okay, I mean, I suppose we should just... For sure. Don't see much compensation. King D1. Why not? I think King D1. We have to predict. Bishop F5, Bishop D3, takes takes, castle. You have Bishop E5, no? Bishop where? Bishop F5, Bishop E5. He's lucky that after Rook E1 there he has Bishop takes C2, but he still feels. Yeah, but I like white. The queen is really saying hello on a fit. <laughs> really? I guess he has bishop g4 coming? Is it working though? Oh, now he has queen f Oh, a7 is saying it. Queen f6 might be. That's why I thought maybe you should go to e3 with your queen before, instead of queen f2. But oh, it's still. Oh, I didn't even see this. Ooh, that's a problem. That's a big problem. Otherwise, yeah. I should just play c3 and king c2. Although it's not, it's not the end of the world. Disturbing. Oh, 
Urbing. I don't know if we can do this, but we'll ask him what he thinks. Wow, just takes it. You have a good move here. Impressive guy. You have a very good move here. I think rook b5 was very strong there, pulled by rook a1. Didn't see what he could do. Rook b5? Yeah, that's... Holy... Oh, we don't have the... Uh... Yeah, we don't have any moves. Unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. Hey, the time is from. Although I've seen you even win with this kind of time, I can smell some hope. That's unlucky. You won't take it, surely. Yeah, I think he's gonna go be okay. <laughs> he's so tricky. I mean, draw is very good there, honestly, with four seconds. Hmm. <laughs> you got <laughs> so close, though. <laughs> you would have had like 0 0.4 seconds more, You would, but the opening was... Yeah, 95 first. Ninety five first. first. You've been cooking something. Takes e4, d4. So. Mm. And this is just the Belgrade, but it's like. I mean, black has to be very careful here, yeah? I think the theory is like, it should be three for some reason. Mm -hmm. And you have this, and some annoying moves, like, not, you, you know, you'll double the pawns or something. You can castle very quickly. I mean, it's like super fun in Blitz, for mm -hmm. sure. Mm -hmm. Let's say if he plays, plays like a beta bishop c5. Yeah. Then he go c3 or? c3, exactly. And you'll go here no matter what. Mm -hmm. And I guess the worst that they can do is like this. Oh, nice, nice. Win yeah. Piece. And like, you know, they're just getting killed here. And if they don't play d6, I mean, you'll still go like this. Mm -hmm. So, you're most probably going to face knight takes e4 or bishop c5, yeah? I think uh, usually you either get bishop c5 or you get somebody who's like wants to be so safe and bishop e7, d6. They castle. get so scared. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, to be honest, there's not a big advantage there, but there's a lot of other ways that they'll mess up. And it's not like you're worse in that situation. Yeah, after bishop e7, do you take the bishop immediately or? You could, and just play d3, c3. I usually like to prolong it, because it could still transpose into other lines. So like more like bishop c4, d4, let everything sure. hang. But if you wanted, you could just take the bishop and just play, like try to use the bishop pair. You know, it's not great, but... Yeah, it's very... It's plain. just something. Yeah, In blitz, at least, it's fine. prolong it like this, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, yes. Your flag takes and They'll go d6, I think. Yeah. They almost always play d6. But then knight takes e7 is even better. No d5 immediately, right? 
Yeah. Oh, it's, it's cool. I'm definitely gonna try this. And uh, you had another one. I'm seeing which. He did knight f6, which is why it was annoying for. Like, he didn't play knight c6. Or I could play some other ones. Ah, now I remember what it was. Uh, you're going 22 here. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Knight. Knight first, yeah. What's. The, does this have a name or? The Joko Bellissimo. After your friend J Bell. It was J Bell's idea. Really? Yep. Didn't know this. Yep. And his last name is Bellissimo. So, kind of, it also sounds like a Joko Piano, Joko Bellissimo. The, the, the Hambo Bellissimo variation. <laughs> yeah, so that was a. That was a good one we had, and of course we have the uh, your buddy the Jerome. Ah, yeah. Yep. And this was also something you just came up with, yeah? This one we, I literally just read a chat comment that said you should try the Jerome, and I was like, well, I've never heard of an opening that's named quite like that, so I was like, what is this? And I just looked it up, and it's this. No oh. one plays it, of course. So of course, if you see someone playing it, it's because probably they saw my video on it, or they've seen me play it on stream. But it's quite bad yet quite good at the same time. It's funny. I mean, I I'm, I want to try. I want to try us. I uh, I, arri I arrived on Friday, Mr. Muskinison. You're uh, you're missed in the house. Uh, missing those December days. Magnus might have missed your. AK performance today. That's right. Good luck, yeah. Because usually he likes to watch when I'm uh, when I'm losing. Yeah, or he might save the vod and watch it after. Like he was, he'll enjoy it that much. I wish I, I wish, wish I could delete uh, delete that <laughs> one, but uh, yeah, he will he will he will see uh, me losing when I woke up. <laughs> <laughs> Happens to the best of us in AK. Getting used to the Arena Kings. <laughs> Tournaments. Yeah, we'll have some matches on uh, Friday. Friday night. We'll definitely have a matchup for you. Have you guys decided who I will play, or you? Uh, I think uh, we wanted to run that the match that you were talking about yesterday. Hmm. You versus Kev. Yeah, I mean, right? I think that's an adoption attempt. Yeah, I mean, as we as we discussed, I can't do that over the board because we'll no, knock online. out all the bits online. I think it's online, of course. It's a, it's a fair match. So, uh, Kevin has three minutes. I have one minute, and mm -hmm. I have to win ten games. Yep. And uh, Maskinison has seen uh, the creativity of Czech Manorov. Both before. on and off the board. On and off the board. So uh, I wonder who he, who he would take in that match. Yeah, I've been practicing some bullet in this trip, so I've been just trying to prepare with all I have against uh, Czech Manorov. <laughs> He's a trick. Very easy to underestimate Czech Manorov. Yeah, looking looking forward. And we're uh, we're going to. Uh, I'm probably going to Madis uh, Madison. What is it? Pub chest. Uh, pub yeah. chest. Yeah. Madison. Yeah. Exactly. Tonight, your your presence will be Mister Maskinison. It's a uh, a classic Madison Wednesday. <laughs> it sounds like you're saying Madis. Madison, Madison, Madison on Wednesday. Madison two, Madison two. Yeah, I think you should take the trip from Calgary. <laughs> He's just in time to make it now. If he, if, if he, he hurries, if he takes the next flight. Mm -hmm. Otari nine nine nine. Is that a fan? Of what? Of me. Oh, you. <laughs> You read it like it was moaning your name. I understand what you mean now. I didn't read it that way at first, but now I see what you're saying. I mean, he couldn't have just made that count right now, though, because he has a high <laughs> rating. But uh, I appreciate uh, the fans. Yeah, D3 is kind of ruin, ruining the... The fun, the yeah? The fun, yeah. You don't need a special system against that, it's, uh, it's not... <laughs> well, I just don't have one. I'm eager to show you uh, some more exciting positions. I'm 
gonna prove you wrong, uh, Wild Hacks. Oh, that you'll take out uh, Big Check? Yeah. I think he'll be impressed, dude. I really do. not to play d4 you have to d4 hurts hmm. and i feel this classy <laughs> 97, yeah, 97 is, is uh, was nasty Guy of culture, so I didn't expect anything else than that. <laughs> Sup, Jeff? Hello, Hello J-Man. Me or a man's bench? Four was probably better. I'm not sure why we went there. At least we would have that move. Quite the stash. Oh, casually I mean, Amon through. is the one that has the belt. That's that's what I was trying to say. But uh, yeah, we we were. Yeah, but, uh, don't sell yourself the, short there, bud. The video is out there on YouTube. It is. They didn't put it on the main channel because they didn't think it's. <laughs> I did a good job, but. Uh, <laughs> If you guys, if you guys want to see uh, my my whole fight against Jabal is out there. It's on Chespra Extra, I think. Mm -hmm. Thanks for subscribing, uh, Christopher Cup. Twenty three months. So you, I hope you're gonna be be here for your uh, two year anniversary next month. The nights are so bad. Uh. Not that easy for him to... Draw, no? It's forced. He has to do it. I think you're seriously the best best in the world with low time in the end game. So that's a lot of like uh, I'm not joking. With that's a lot of things that you have to say before I'm the best in the world. You know? Best in the world on a Tuesday, rainy <laughs> weather. <laughs> oh but I've seen you pull it off so many times. I mean that's the last game when you had four seconds to the but now I might jinx it. That one hurts, doesn't it, buddy? Still my phone. <laughs> oh, we tried. We gave it our uh, 
But he was our very, best. But he was very scared. Problem of, is, like, uh, but he I was very a... scared of humble defense. Well, I didn't. I didn't get any openings to show you here. E and D three. We have to keep trying. I realized. Uh, geez, we gotta. I think we gotta switch to uh, kick here quickly. <laughs> we gotta. We gotta go to the opening ceremony kind of soon, right? Yeah. When does that exactly start? Seven. I was told. Seven. Okay. It's pretty soon. Gotta switch to kick here, so. Uh, Dressed up soon. We can. Uh, yeah, exactly. Better luck, of course. No, I'm trying to get a few games, show Aryan, you know, what we've been cooking in the lab here in Canada. I, uh... Maybe he'll try it out. I'm definitely going to try the Hambo defense. That's <laughs> Christopher Cup. Thanks that's what for I've the been prime. missing. 